Joe, you've been talking about it. You've finally made the decision. Thibaut Courtois is your number one this season. Tell me uh, the reasons behind that decision. Thibaut Courtois is my number one tonight against uh, against Burnley. Uh, let's see next uh, next week. I don't make decisions for the for the season. I make decisions for a uh, for a match. Obviously, a goalkeeper is not the kind of player you are uh, changing uh, match after match. You you must give a little bit of. Uh, of a stability, but this is about uh, about performances. So Thibaut has to know that uh, having a, a goalkeeper at, Pit, at Peter's uh, level uh, sitting on on the bench demands from him high level performances. Of course, it's not a guarantee he'll be there the whole season. But you said you prefer to have a goalkeeper who's your regular keeper. You've now made that decision. What made you decide to go with him? You know, uh, ten years ago, I had uh, also a very difficult decision to uh, to make when we had uh, Kudicini giving fantastic performances in in Chelsea's goal uh, for many years, and uh, I made a decision for Peter on the season 2004-2005 because I had in my in my hands a 22-year-old uh, goalkeeper that I thought could be in Chelsea's goal for uh, years and years and years and uh, this situation is um, is quite similar obviously Peter is uh, an amazing uh, goalkeeper but the difference between them is 10 is 10 years and uh, we think that we have to think about um, the future of the club and made the decision to to give the goal to um, to Courtois but I repeat uh, I'm so so comfortable and and feeling so safe by having these two goalkeepers with uh, with us, obviously with which Varger too, but to have this this top uh, level goalkeepers is a fantastic situation for us. How has Petr Cech responded? Uh, Petr is a fantastic professional, so he only knew uh, my decision this uh, uh, this morning. He fought hard for his place during the whole the whole preseason to put himself in in conditions to be ready to play and obviously is ready to play um, how does he behave in a professional way which is what uh, we expect from him because uh, he was always a fantastic professional and and for sure he wants to be the same but um, i hope and for sure that that is going to happen he will fight for his for his place he will not sit in a in a comfortable chair accepting uh, the number two position that's what i i don't hope and I don't expect from him because he's a he's a winner, he's a fighter, and he will he will fight for his place. Jose, thanks for talking to us. Thank you.